will Lamis theorem, this is a basic concept in plus one Lemmis. Lemmis theorem is very useful in calculating the number of concepts in numericals and multiple choice questions as well. What Lemmis theorem is all about, let us do and revise. Three vectors A, B, C are represented by the sides P, Q, Q R and R P in magnitude and direction. Then vector A is just opposite to an alpha, B that is beta and C that is gamma. So, you all know according to the triangle's law, if the two vectors are represented by the two sides of a triangle and resultant is completely given by the closing side taken in opposite order that give us vector A plus B plus C equal to 0. Now, multiplying with the vector A according to the cross product A cross A, A cross B, A cross C. Remember students, do not change the order. If you put A here, A here, A here. Sometimes we do by mistake, we write B first A, C first A. Well, that is not in accordance with the uh, ve uh, vector product. So, A cross A collinear vector 0, then A cross B equal to minus of A cross C. If you absorb this negative sign, it becomes C cross A. Similarly, B cross C, A cross B, C cross A equal to B cross C. Now, what do you find? Between vector A and vector B, the angle is 180 minus gamma. We will take the exterior angle. We will take the exterior angle. We will not take the interior angle. Similarly, the angle between B and C is 180 minus alpha. Angle between A and C is 180 minus alpha. Now, students, A B sin 180 minus alpha, C A sin 180 minus beta, that is A B sin alpha, C A sin beta, B C sin alpha, A B sin gamma, C A sin beta, B C sin alpha. From first, second and third, you find A B equal to sin gamma, B C equal to sin alpha, C A equal to sin beta. Dividing both sides by A B C, you will find sin gamma upon C, sin alpha upon A, sin beta upon B or A upon sin alpha, B upon sin beta, C upon